Well, this is a collaborative project. This one in particular is a collaborative project through WVU's education program. And what we have done, we've taken the... Our students have gone and they've researched this lettuce and they've taken it and they've planted it and done seedlings. And what we've done with it is we've learned skills like fractions and we've learned percentages and decimals. Um, we've done area and perimeter we just did yesterday and today. We are transplanting all of our things into the garden so that we can continue our unit. We've got, all, we've got six different types. Uh, the kids probably know more about it than I have because they have researched it for weeks now. But some of the things, we've got a lot of, a lot of different types of romaine and we've got like Coastal Star, Green Forest Lettuce, um, Alkendus Butterhead, Nancy Butterhead Lettuce as well. well the, the end result of this, after it starts to actually grow and get a little bit bigger, we're actually going to be harvesting it and they're going to use it in our cafeteria. Especially since the, the kind of lettuce that we have, it can be harvested and it will regrow again. Yeah, we've got a lot of teachers that are doing a lot of the garden-based learning uh, units here. I, I did one last year, I started one last year with raspberries um, and strawberries. But it's just, I am by no means a gardener. But I, I don't have to be a gardener for this because it's sort of just a, a platform for the students to be motivated. They're excited to learn about fractions, whereas maybe normally they wouldn't be super excited to do it because it's in a real world world setting that they're able to use. With this this particular one, um, I have an intern from WVU's education program and she actually came to me first and asked me if I would be interested in running a, this unit with her that she had she had previously used in a fifth grade classroom and she just sort of wanted to try it again with a, a lower grade. So that's sort of how it started and then we sort of just had a partnership and she teaches part of it and I teach part of it as well. This is, I think, this is probably our third week now. Um, we used a special kind of seed, it's a pelleted seed, so they, most of them started to germinate and sprout over the weekend because we did it on a Friday and we came back and most of them had already started to, to germinate, but we had to wait for them to get to this process before, before we could start transplanting them to the greenhouse. I think what they are getting mostly out of this is that I, I have not been asked once how is this relevant to me? How am I going to use fractions or percentages or decimals in the real world? Because they're actually doing it already. So they're already, they're already having a real world application to what the skills that they're getting.